everybody and welcome back to another video. Today I'm here with five simple house designs for your Minecraft world. So the first de decor idea I'm going to show you is an aquarium. Um, and obviously you've probably seen aquariums before in Minecraft. Uh, if you haven't, they're pretty neat. You can see all the fish inside there and the coral. But one thing that's special about this one is it has a little bit of a secret feature. So if you look closely as I press this button here, you see that a trapdoor opens and bubbles come out, uh, like those treasure chests in the um, in the aquariums. You know the ones that open like and release a bunch of bubbles. I've made one of those for your Minecraft world. It's pretty simple to do. All you have to do is go down here. I'll show you. The button is right there, and it's right above a block that leads down to some redstone. Ignore my awful redstone here, and you just link it up to here. And it goes right into that um, trap door there and right. Uh, let me go show you right here. Underneath there is a little area containing a piece of soul sand. And that's what creates the bubble effect. Yeah, so that's that's all to that one, really. Um, let me show you a couple more times. I click. There goes a bunch of bubbles and it shuts. Boom. There goes a bunch of bubbles and it shuts. Alright, so that's the first one. Uh, the next one we're going to look at is a design for a uh, canopy bed in a bedroom area. Ignore my pretty lacking bedroom here. But I've used slabs and fences to create sort of a canopy effect. Uh, and if you wanted to, you could even, in your own house, make a kind of a skylight window up here. So as you're laying down in bed, you can look up at the stars as you sleep. Yeah, so it's as simple as just putting some banners along the outside of your bed. It makes a nice effect. You can kind of see how it would be kind of nice and cozy in here. And you got bookshelves and just the basic decorations for your for your Minecraft bedroom. Alright, um, this is a lamp decoration. It's a, kind of a bonus decor. I didn't even realize. I, didn't, I just made these for some nice lighting up to the next one. But... but it's as simple as just some slabs and a lantern hanging down. It lights up your path pretty nice. Um, so this is decor idea three. And it's one of the more complex ones in this uh, episode. And what it is, is it's this fireplace here. Um, so as you can see, this isn't like a real fireplace that leads up, but it's four campfires that produce smoke to make it really look like it's a campfire in there. Um, and if you're wondering how to get this, it's a campfire plus a bucket of water. I'll show you out here. You place your campfire and you extinguish it with a bucket of water. And it's as simple as that. And it gives you this kind of nice this nice wooden material here. Yeah, so there's a lot you can do with that and that might be used in one of my future videos. So stay tuned for that. So that's how I got that, and it's just campfires, and on the exterior here, you can see that it's just a mess of cobblestone. But th the purpose of it is to make it a really rough cobblestone um, textured chimney uh, area. Um, and out the top here, like if you're looking at it from a distance, you can see that it looks like a real smoking chimney, which is part of the effect of this kind of build. Um, and all it is, is up here at the top when you're finished building, it's a one block space. And all you do is you throw a campfire in there. And it starts producing smoke like crazy. And I think it it's a really nice look. Makes it look like it's really smoking out of the top from the fireplace down in the bottom. Uh, yeah, so the next one we're going to move on to is a couple of designs for writing desks or desks in your house to make it look a little... Make it look a little nicer in there. So this is like the most basic one here. Uh, it's just, it's just a stair up against some wooden blocks with some armrests on it. It's not really functional, but it looks all right in the grand scheme of your house. Um, the next one we're going to take a look at is a little bit of an upgrade from that. It's using stairs and slabs instead of just blocks. Um, and it gives it a little space under the desk and you're able to come you're not really able to sit up here yet 
but uh, you can add a pressure plate and a lantern, and it, and it looks a little bit neater for your house. Um, this is the next one, and this one you can actually sit at. Um, and if you haven't seen a lectern before, it is just a... It's a thing where you can place a book on it. Uh, it's used for redstone stuff, but it also looks pretty cool, and it and it can really be used to... to you can take the book, and you can... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Hold on, let me go over here and grab this. You can even write in it. You can write in it, and then you place it on here. And then you've got la 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 sub to catnip on here, um, and so you can really you can really use this as a functional writing desk here, uh, and it's it's really neat. So that's that's an upgrade from the previous two, and this is the final one, and it's the best, in my opinion, it is the absolute best design. Um, so not only is it functional with the lectern, but you can you can actually sit in this one. So you can sit here and you can put your book and quill and you can you can look at your book and quill and when you're done you just hop out. And I think it's the coolest one because it actually functions. You can actually sit down in it, do your writing, look at your book, and then get out and continue along with the rest of your day. So these are these are some easy desk designs uh, and I'll actually show you how to do this one. So with this one you're going to need a minecart, rail, a piston, not a sticky piston, just a regular piston, a lever or some other redstone device, oak wood stairs or whatever wood you're, you're using, uh, oak wood signs. And that's just for this chair portion. Um, the other things use other things. Okay, so how you're going to build this one is you're going to start... So how you build these desks is you get a block and you place a stair looking like this. Then you can add however many slabs you want. And then another end table bit. And then you place your lectern to give it the, the functionality of that. Uh, and that's all you're gonna need for those two pieces. Um, you put the book and quill in, and then you're gonna place a rail. You're gonna put the minecart on the rail, break down a block, and you're gonna go under until you see the highlighting of the rail. You're gonna break just the rail, not the minecart, just the rail. Um, and then you're going to put the seat down the direction you want it, the piston behind it, facing so it'll push the stairs into the minecart. And all you're going to do is push the piston. And that will send the stair through the minecart. And you can proceed to... You can proceed to... Decorate your chair as you please. Um, and so that's how you build one of those that actually functions like a real chair. Um, yeah. And the last build uh, decoration idea we have for today is right here. And it's a sort of enclosed uh, atrium cage kind of thing. And this is, this is customizable for any biome you like. You can use any wood, any grass, um, any leaves. Like if you, let's say you wanted to make it a spruce one. That's easily doable. You place the wood, and then you make it look like a spruce tree. Done. And then, let's say you wanted to make it, you wanted to really go full effect for the, um, for the Tega snow biome theme. You could replace these. This is a sea lantern with a carpet over it. Excuse me. Um, that's it's, it's, that's a simple way to hide a lighting to fit with um, grass and such is to place a, a covering like that over it and then you just put some snow down and 
then it it really gives the complete new uh so that's the last design for today everybody i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did like it make sure to subscribe and tune in next time for more videos just like this see ya